a satisfying win over the Spurs. The 76ers looking to make it four straight wins and get back to the 500 mark. Hosting Detroit tonight on NBC Sports Philadelphia. Back on October 23rd after losing their first three of the season. And we are running tonight. Four straight at home. Their next game, they'll be the home team in London against Boston. That is Tobias get him downstairs to the weight room. An aggressive Ben Simmons once. Simmons now with a 6-7 Bullock on him. It's a three from Sharich. All cotton. Second to Joel Embiid, averaging eight and a half boards per game. So the Sixers, after giving up the first two points, now have scored nine straight. Joel Embiid's footsteps. Nice look. Indeed by Simmons. That's got to be a timeout for Stan. Jay McConnell for the first time in for J.J. Redick. Simmons, I dare say, feasting right now. The Sixers right now in the midst of a 15-0 push. Here is Harris, and he gets a tough two. Tobias Bucket took it right to the hole off the glass. How about the trade by the Pistons? Get him from Orlando. As Simmons definitely hits beat and charge taking a break. Amir Johnson and Jared Bayless on the floor for the first time. Oh, Ish Smith getting all the way to the cup for two. Was anticipating that double team coming. No need to foul and bail him out. First on him, first on the team. Helping out Bayless defensively. Another big show, first by Joel, that time by Amir. Bullock is for three, and down it goes for Reggie. Their share of injury, Stanley Johnson among those hurt, as that time the big guy Drummond. He is on the floor for the first time. Avery Bradley to the bench. Commonly a G League player, five years out of college. High speed, J.J. Redick. Redick fading away and scoring the shot that J.J. makes. Joel Embiid saying no to Dwight Bikes. Redick the naked three and down it goes. He's thinking two possessions for one. That's why you jack it there. Yeah, and also Bullock, he feels like got a little contact on him on the way down as well. Referee's not calling. Bullock, one of the few easy baskets. The Pistons have a foul to give here. A little more than two seconds separating the clocks. And B clearly has a mismatch here with the 6-3 Dwight Bikes. And as he takes him, he is fouled. You can count it. I'd like to mix in the, the assist, too. A fine assist. Last time out, Brett Brown clearly pleased with the entire group with only two fouls in that opening period. Brett said, oh. a gorgeous fake on him, but unfinished business with a left hand. Luau Cabarro, he hits the three. Oh, recently, Mr. Galloway, they need all of that with the absence of Jackson. And Bede, a little sleight of hand on Drummond. Have you ever had sore ribs? Not no. fun, not fun. Tough to breathe, tough yeah, to take right. deep breaths, and if you get hit in it, God forbid. I'll give him credit for trying to play tonight. Nowadays, one of those guys that not only did you follow on the court, but off the court as well. Never let you down. From the sixth grade all the way until I graduated high school. I saw it first thing in the morning and the last thing before I went to bed. He gave it to me. The nearly tied up is Smith. The Sixers get the turnover anyway. Sharich, the Euro step, and a foul. Appreciate the clarification there. Just a matter of a couple days ago, they were before the season. Jared Bayless joins the party. Sixers will be the home team taking on the Boston Celtics. Get home from school early, call a half a day at work, whatever you got to do. You say that, and you're right, it is his shooting hand, quote unquote. But when you talk with Ben about which is your dominant hand, he literally says, a but you'd be okay with Robert shooting that from that position. It's one of the reasons why he's there. Yep. Simmons, great hustle, kept it alive, cruising in and slamming for... Redick for three. Double Detroit score. Now, I would have said about five minutes ago that you know you'd be hearing from Detroit, but I'm not sure. They've done anything otherworldly. They've just been solid, yep. and solid has been good enough. Ben Simmons, and the Sixers are fresh 24. Nice. Reddick, nice. nice spot of Covington. You know what, that's J.J. Reddick saying. Points of the game, comes in averaging 14.
is Smith along with Avery Bradley in the backcourt for Detroit. That's blocked by Simmons, his second snuff of the game. Harris for a three, and he drops it. And it doesn't. Drummond with the steal. Simmons tracking him. Covington thinking three. Charge. He'll try it. And down it goes. So after trying to rush, but they were also very patient. Got the shot they wanted. Good ball movement until they got the open man. Reddick, a slipping charge. Covington for three. Yes! Robert Covington striking them because the official says it's not a reach. Yeah. <laughs> ben Simmons, the 15th of this month, when they were 14 and 14, trying to go to 19 and 19. Pistons didn't know what they wanted to do on offense, and then the Sixers not fouling anybody and allowing that shot to go off. Robert Covington continue to blow this game wide open. They're up 39 points for the first time. Show Tolliver a hand at least. And B connects and the 76ers. Game like this, there's not many positives you can glean from a tape like this. It is the largest lead of the season for the Sixers. Fought his way into the lead. Cups of coffee with Toronto, the Lakers. This is not the same team without Reggie Jackson. I think that's the bottom line. Yeah, but I bring home a W for the Pistons tonight. However, you could just tell watching them play, having seen them earlier on in the season, they don't run their sets like they're, we're used to them running. Sixers, the big ticket item for them tonight, their three-point shooting. They made 11 threes. And that's Kennard, it's gonna get this 37 or 36 point lead. You're thinking about 0-0, win every possession. That's what you're trying to do. No doubt. Johnson, nice spot of McConnell, returning the favor to Amir. Fargo Center. They would have gotten booed in Detroit playing the way they played tonight. McAdoo got his championship ring. He scored a bucket in the game as Spikes gets the layup. Trying to prove himself to Coach Van Gundy. Listen, Nick Stauskas didn't get much playing time here. That's McAdoo for three, and he hit it. Hashtag NBA vote, Mark. It's tough, Molly. We thank you so much. It's been coined the Ben and Joe show. It's going to be a goaltending, by the way. Well, Anthony Towns is one of the more popular Dominican players. And they're showing some range. The big upset that he missed it. We're going to see a game in London at the O2 Arena. That, that game's been sold out for months. Yeah, it's a big deal. It's a big deal. The soccer. Wow, Cabro for a three, and that has to help him. Timote, you know what? If this isn't tough enough for the Pistons, tomorrow they have to go home and play Houston. Right. Who do we talk to about setting up another kind of evening like this? We'll take the season series from Detroit. And that might not excite you initially, but when you think about it. Keep playing. Keep playing. These minutes are as important to you as the starters of minutes are to them. Wow, a Cabrera, another three. Well done. Waning a bit. Yep, indeed. You do whatever you got to do to feel better about your Two game. T.J. McConnell. To the 500 mark for the first time since they were 14 and 14. They are 19 and 19, and they are also 500 at home, where they have won two straight.